Hey guys, so I made a New Year's resolution that uh, I was going to try to actually post more often this year. Whether it's a, whether it's a high quality production video or not, I'm just going to try to post something every day. So for now, I'm just going to be making these like short little snippet videos to, I don't know, I guess get used to talking in front of the cameras because that's one of the things I've always had trouble on is, uh, talking in front of a camera always just um i don't know why it makes me nervous which is really weird because when i talk in real life to large group of people uh doing a demonstration I, it's different I, I don't know i guess maybe it's the idea of like oh shoot like maybe thousands of people could watch this video and what if i sound kind of stupid uh whatever i say but i'm like you know what we have such a short span of life on this planet that uh that's something pretty stupid to worry about so i'm not even gonna think about that anyways besides that uh today's topic i kind of wanted to talk about and we can talk you guys can talk about it in the comment section because i want to hear your guys opinion i i don't understand why uh we live in a world where when people watch a video it's almost as if some people like some people's instant uh instinct is to just like leave a hate comment right and i get it right like oh it's the internet get used to it that's just how it is like okay yeah no i know i know but i just it it, it just kind of fascinates me right it fascinates me more than anything because i i just look at the hate comment i'm like oh damn i it i just i really it uh really makes me think like how how what leads a person to be so hateful you know like, the comment itself doesn't upset me, right? Because, I don't know, at least for me, I haven't really gotten any hate comments on this channel from my recollection, or, I don't know. I, I have a goldfish brain, so maybe I do have hate comments, and I just haven't been paying attention, but, uh, whatever. I was, um, you know, scrolling through social media, and I saw this, uh, this post or whatever. It was by the... the I'm pretty sure you guys know who the Trend Twins are. Uh, I don't really watch their stuff, to be honest with you. So, I don't know. Uh, keep in mind, I'm going into this context that... Um, all I know is that the Trend Twins are very popular fitness influencers. I've seen, like, maybe some snippets of, like, the videos. Uh, not really my cup of tea. Um, I... I I don't know, I just can't, <laughs> I can't take all the screaming seriously, you know, but like I said, um, that doesn't make me hate them necessarily, I just, I just don't watch their videos, uh, it's not something I could really, uh, see myself watching, you know, uh, but they're, they're pretty funny from time to time if you just watch clips of videos, but aside from that, um, what I'm trying to say is that I don't know any of, like, the past, uh, controversy they may have maybe you guys could fill me in and why all this hate is uh going towards them but i saw like one comment right it it was like oh nothing but some uh five foot uh midgets or something dwarfs or i, I don't know like something like that like five foot uh, i don't know uh roy goblins or something I don't know. it's just a stupid thing and i just think it's also it's like damn bro like some people really like live their lives just like they they hate you know and it what really blows my mind is these people will waste their time and you know i'm, I'm being hypocritical right because i'm wasting my time reading through this chain of comments right but uh wait, one sec all right, sorry about that. I'm back. Okay, but yeah, like I was saying, um, yeah, it takes a lot to uh, really. It takes a lot to hate, you know, a lot of energy, wasted energy, and you know, um, maybe I'm being hypocritical because I'm wasting my time even reading through this. But I kind of just read through it a little bit just to, you know, see what's going on and after analyzing it a bit, I think I've come to the conclusion that I think these people, um, they have a lot of free time on their hands, obviously, which, I mean, they have a lot of free time, but I don't know if there's probably more productive things they could be putting that free time into, but whatever. And I think 
the psychic, uh, the psyche behind it is that, um, because these people aren't doing as well as they would want in their lives, that they feel the need to just seek gratification. I think that's why they leave that hate comment because they have hopes that, uh, someone will agree with them, right? They want to seek some type of gratification because I, I think that's just a natural human uh, want the wanting to be uh, supported or um, applauded for an action. So rather than do something productive, they're just going to leave a, um, I don't know, a hate opinion as what I like to call it. Like I don't like this person because of this, and yeah, and they they want someone to like be like, oh yeah, I don't like this person either, and. Um, when they get a bunch of comments back of people not agreeing with the hate comment, then that's when they get defensive and they will respond to every single hate comment. No matter how uh, moronic their response is, they'll still leave a response and hold to their guts on what they said. So anyways, uh, you know, this person left this comment about the making fun of the height or whatever and how they're nothing but just a bunch of like, steroid users or whatever right and you know we can get on a whole another topic about um peds and uh what those are but i i don't really care um i don't know i don't really have an opinion on ped use and, and that's a whole other topic like i said aside from that what they were mainly focused on was the height and i'm just thinking to myself man we still live in a day of age where you have people who who actually, like, they make fun of people for their height. Like, I was just thinking to myself, like, imagine. Imagine being so insecure, because I think it stems from insecurity about themselves, right? That there are people out there who who rely on their height to define their worth as a person. So I think, and maybe I'm being biased because this is coming from a short person here. I, I'm uh, on the shorter side of the spectrum of myself, uh, standing at five, six, you know? So, cause I think what, like the average American male height is, a. Uh, 5'8 to 5'9 is the average height. So I, I'm shorter. So maybe this is stemming from, uh, I don't know, bias. But I, at least from what I'm seeing, and like, keep in mind, you know, like I said, I could be biased. I see a lot of people who tend to be on the taller side, right? Maybe six foot ish, mm, six two, six three, right? And it's not all of them, right? I don't want everybody to be like, oh, this guy, this this uh, man lit or whatever, he's he's hating on tall people because he wants to be tall himself. He's not, no, no, that's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying it's all tall people. It's just very select, very select few tall people. And it's a, a lot of the time it is taller people, right? But here's the thing. It's only coming from taller people who I think they have something that they don't like about themselves, right? So they feel the need to um, belittle people because the only thing that they can rely on is something that they didn't even have to work for. Like, you don't have to work towards being tall. I mean, I, I don't know. I guess unless in puberty you did, like, stretching exercises because, I don't know, there's studies that show that doing certain kinds of stretches and um, hanging on certain things could help increase your height even more or... Um, during puberty also with what you eat and stuff like that nutrition but uh, a lot of the times i think it's just genetics you know you don't work towards being tall you unless you get height surgery that's a whole nother thing but we can talk about that later because i do want to talk about that also but uh yeah there are people out there who um i think they why they these taller people it and it's only like a small group right i would say maybe like 20 10% of like the tall people population. I wouldn't even say like it probably even less than that, you know, because the thing about haters, there's not really a lot of them. I feel I just think like 
haters, unfortunately, they speak the loudest. And that's the sad truth. And, but yeah, they, uh, I think they, uh, talk a lot of hate because, you know, the only thing that they've ever relied on to be positive about themselves is their height. They have nothing else going for them, so they want to belittle someone just because that person, well, that person's shorter than me, so I'm, I'm better than him. I mean, yeah, he may have more muscle than me, but, you know, he just has more muscle because he's shorter, or he has a shorter range of motion, and I'm like, that's been proven to not be necessarily true. Well, I do agree that, yes, there is obviously advantages of the range of motion factor, but I don't know, dude, um, a lot of the strong mother efforts that I know in the gym, like, they're tall, it's like six foot, I've seen like six foot four guys who are still jacked, and I know, like, they're not taking PDs, right, they're still natty, you know, so you can't be like, oh, well, you know, I'm just not muscular because I'm tall, you know, really? You're going to really use that excuse? Or is it that you just don't want to admit that you're not really putting in the work? You know, because I, I don't think it has anything to do with height. You know, there's advantages and disadvantages to all kinds of heights, you know. And, you know, I, I think um, instead of, like, putting all this energy and hate into hating someone for... Um, something that can't control like their height how about you just work on bettering yourself you know i don't know i just wanted to hear your guys opinion because it's not something that like i would say like grinds my gears i don't know what to call it but it is something that like kind of like bugs me a little bit i'm like what <laughs> like wait what's what 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 is up with these people like i don't understand why they can't just like focus on themselves or you know but yeah. Alright. Well. I think I'm done for today. I don't, I don't really have any much to, else to say. I, I think I'm just rambling at this point. But uh, if you made it this far on the video. Thank you. Um, I'm going to try to put a lot more videos out there. Uh, work on. Getting better production videos. I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if you guys want to make uh, see me make. Uh, workout tutorial videos. Mm, I don't know if I'm really there yet be able to do that um working towards my getting my uh physical trainer certification right now I, I know i i do have a lot of knowledge that i've picked up along the way but i feel like i'd feel have that extra sense of confidence if i knew i had that um certification man you know i still got to do a little bit more studying on human anatomy and uh yeah i'll be able to make more informed workout videos for you guys in the future but uh yeah all right i'm rambling again all right i'll see you guys thanks for watching bye